lesson number six video number one create wps work breakdown structure in promovir one of the first important steps to create a detailed time schedule is to create a proper work breakdown structure wps to prepare a professional work breakdown structure wps it is highly recommended to follow the csi international division and subdivision system which already applied to our bill of quantity as explained in lesson number five to help you further find below the attached work breakdown structure wps excel sheet this includes all the main divisions and subdivision coding system this will help you to uh, break down all the activities and will give you a very good understanding how to break down any activity in any division or subdivision let's go and see how it look like this excel sheet and how it can help us if your bill of quantity not already divided by the csi international division and subdivision this is the excel file you can download from the link below you will find that it is divided into divisions and subdivisions so division zero it is a specification section and uh, it can be divided into all this subdivision so if we go to something common like site construction inside construction you can divide your or uh, or break down your activities into all of these subdivisions so it will give you a very good understanding how to break down each division of work so let's say if we have the concrete we have concrete here it is divided by too many subdivisions and you can see here these numbers it is a good reference if you want to put it in your WPS so if you are not sure how to divide the masonry work you can just go the, to this one you can make it to you can check the subdivision here it will give you a good idea how to divide your division into further subdivisions according to the international CSR okay now we'll go to Primavera to check how to create our WPS work breakdown structure so simply I'll go to create a new project and I will call it planning engineer and I will start creating my WPS so I'll close all the project in case I have another project are open and I'll right click and open only the planning engineer project we already have our WPS created in the uh, previous lesson uh, for the in the cost loading so from lesson number five open the cost loading and you'll find that we already divided the works into a smaller components so this one is a, is a WPS level this is another WPS level this is a WPS level and so on so I'm going to use the same uh, breakdown we used in our WPS and to create uh, just to create it in the Primavera so the first thing I'll go to here from project WPS this is the first WPS level which is planning engineer so I'm going to add a new one and I will call it construction work
and under the construction work I will start adding my levels here so the first thing I have here is the substructure I just copy the substructure open the Primavera add a new one I'll call it substructure I'm going to the Excel again I just I'll close this one and under the substructure I have earthwork so simply I'll go to add earthwork then I'll add another level but I want this level to be in the same level of the substructure so from this arrow I'm going to make it same level as this is the same level as earthwork now so I'm going to use this arrow to make it the same level as substructure so substructure if I close substructure you'll find earthwork and you'll find another level here and I want the concrete work to be under substructure so if, if I want to make this concrete work under substructure so I'll just use the arrow or just I can click this one and make it under substructure so this arrows I can use it to make it up or down or I can make one further move to the left or move to the right level I'll continue adding new levels I have here waterproofing works I'll add a new level and make it the same in the same level under substructure. So this is waterproofing. Then I'll go to another level which is sub uh, superstructure. In the superstructure, I'll add a new level for the superstructure and I'll make it the same level as substructure. So this is a level. This is the same level. And under the superstructure, I will start adding new levels, which is ground floor. By adding a new one here. Ground floor. First floor. Add a new one. Second floor. A new one. Third floor. Then This is as per my WPS I, cre I created earlier in the cost loan. Okay, now I'll go to another level which is the rough finishes. Here in the rough finishes, I'll add a new level rough finishes. This rough finishes should be same level to superstructure and I have to add here ground floor first floor second floor again the same WPS I added to the uh, superstructure so simply I can click the first one and click shift key select the last one right click copy and I'll come here right click paste then it will ask me what to copy of course it's empty so just I'll click OK and then I will add I'll check here in my WPS I have final finishes as well 
which is divided into the same WPS so simply I'll copy this one then I'll paste it anywhere okay then I can move it out like this and I can I'll go to copy the WPS name which is final finishes then I'll go to here final finishes this will be my level again we'll check what is remaining after the final finishes we have electrical works so I'm going to copy this one again paste it here I'll check don't show this dialog again okay then I change the name by click this one copy and I will paste it here this will be the electrical works let's see what else we have here all this related to electrical works ah we have here mechanical works so from Primavera I'll copy the electrical paste it in the same level then using the arrow I'll choose the correct level and this will be the mechanical works what else remaining here in our WPS firefighting works so I'm going to copy this one again paste it and using the arrow copy the firefighting works and here it is going down again I have here conveying system In that case, I will add a new level. I'll call it conveying system. Then I will add a level underneath. I'll call it all floors. All floors. Then I'll add another level this level is the close out and the close out has all floors as well so this will take will now i completed the whole wps let's go and see how it look like so you can go to the project activities and here is our WPS we just created we completed it let's go and see what is the next system